Thank you very much, uh, Secretary General, for those remarks. And um, I join her in welcoming you all to this uh, SIS Leaders uh, Meeting, and um, as well as your, your delegation that accompanied you to Nauru. Um, a big welcome to you all. Uh, this year's theme is um, a very appropriate one, we thought, that we share and we journey along together using it as, a, as our basis and building a strong Pacific. Our people, our islands and our will. Uh, this is in alignment also uh, uh, with the, the Blue Pacific narrative and, and its significance to the Pacific region and in particular SIS. Now, I'd like to congratulate uh, Honorable Henry Puna in his recent successful re-election and look forward uh, to the final results of the Cook Islands general election if that's not, uh, it's not been finalized yet, but I think very soon. <laughs> Yes, and um, now the, the issues that are brought to the SIS uh, to, the, to today's meeting are those uh, are of specific importance, specific importance and, uh, and of strategic value to SIS, particularly in relation to progressing specific work as mandated by SIS leaders under the SIS regional strategy. And I would encourage all leaders to coordinate their efforts and, and caucus on issues of collective importance and priority to SIS to ensure that where necessary, their decisions today are co uh, collectively supported in the forum leaders' retreat and accurately reflected in the forum leaders' communique. We emphasize the importance of this uh, opportunity to build a solidarity on issues of common and special interest to SIS uh, during the course of this week's meeting of the Pacific Islands Forum. Let me acknowledge the Secretariat and the and crop agencies for the documentation for the meeting and their ongoing support uh, to the implementation of regional SIS priorities and issues identified under the SIS regional strategy. I also acknowledge the work of SIS officials in adhering to the leader's directive of ensuring a strategic and pertinent set of issues to put, is put forth for their consideration. And let me remind leaders of the timeless timelines set for this meeting and encourage concise and constructive deliberations so that work can be completed within the time allocated. <clears throat> 